All right, guys, welcome back. How's it going? I am Dave. I'm my Feed the Beast Monster LP, um, and today I'm going to do a little bit of cleanup. Uh, I've got a couple of projects started that need to be uh, finished. Um, I'm doing some. I'm, I'm having a very huge lack of redstone as well as gold. So I'm experimenting with the bees, and I started to make uh, some of the oops, some of the other bee uh, machines, the carpenter, and making the basic circuit board. I'm going to continue on here because um, even though this this stuff was cheap and it's easy to power, well, lag there. Um, it doesn't it doesn't give me the control uh, that I'm looking for when making my own custom bees. So I'm going to keep this stuff here. Uh, the industrial apiary is nice because I can control whatever I need the, it to be uh, without having to go through uh, imperial, which I'm still doing, getting the royal jelly and the industrious getting the pollen. Um, I also have my redstone bees going, which I would like to get the, the, the trait off of them that makes them do redstone. I mean, as you can see, I've done a ton of generations, and he's... I've taken redstone out of here, but it's just not really producing a ton. Um, down here as well, oop, God, I never fired set on fire, but the Lux Bee is creating glowstone for me. And that's what's creating my mutagen right here. <laughs> Sorry, I had a little cough there. So let me show you the other projects that I'm working on. Um, we're going to do this as well someday. I'm going to, I need to make armor and we're going to make uh, a beacon, I think. We got this tower right here, and you can see it's kind of jutting out. Um, I'll come back to that because I think that's what I'm going to finish today. Uh, but then we got this other building back here. I'm making a little pathway to it, and um, it's starting to get dark. But this is going to be my spawner room, um, and I set up uh, some grinders along that side, fans along that side to blow them into the grinders, and the spawner will be in the top there. And uh, what I'll do is whatever I'm working on, I'll come in, set it up, turn it on, and the controls will all be here. This is going to be fixed. I ran out of wood, but I needed something to stand here. Um, and this will be my spawner room. Uh, I'm probably going to get the blackout things here just to kind of tidy this up and make it so it's dark in here. Uh, or I'll just put three doors. I don't know. Uh, but this is going to be finished up. Uh, the grinders are taking a little bit of time due to the lack of gold. Um, I have my quarry going uh, over there, but then I have this building. Let me go make it daytime real quick. Okay, so we have this building here, and this is what is taking the place of my um, farm over there, because that's ugly and I want to get rid of it. That one's probably more efficient, but uh, I've, I've got a decent amount of biofuel now that it's not that big of a deal, and I can, I can boost it. Um, so... I was experimenting, there's some cows on top, and I was experimenting with if the fertilizer would make these grow faster, and it doesn't. So we're going to end up we're gonna end up removing this and getting rid of all this stuff and then getting rid of the cows on top. Um, I'm just going to have uh, a harvester here and a harvester on that floor, harvesting constantly, and then sending into the building to burn and make into biofuel. Um, if a situation, I mean, because this was this was a really nice, really big one. And what was the radius? Emerald, eleven increased. It's not bad. Do I want to make it that big? It's just a huge building. I don't know. We'll get that set up, and then we'll we'll see if it's just not producing. Because I mean, down here we still have. Um, Oh yeah, I have this turned on with uh, gold as well as experience to get those filled back up again. The watering can doesn't work on these anymore, so that little trick uh, doesn't speed that up. I am using this for power. Um, the rancher with milk into the biofuel generator. While th this is going to get fixed in the next patch, but I'm like, I might as well get some energy off of it while it's broken. Um, but I do have these guys in here still, and they're still making... A decent amount of biofuel. It's in there, biofuel. Yeah, I mean, it's there's 14 buckets in there, and these are full and creating electricity. So it's quite a mess down here. Um, but 
that's what I want to do is I want to get this building tidied up and finished so let me get the stuff I need I need to get another harvester and then we'll kill the cows on top and set it all up so that it comes in hits a furnace and then uh, does that so let me uh, let me get the materials ready for that and I will be right back alright so here's the issue I run into with this setup is uh, this guy is right here and he needs three things he needs power he needs to get the items out and he needs to get um, sludge out jump piping into my system the way I need to so I end up losing a spot right there which is which is fine whatever it's not incredibly super efficient that that's making a difference um, it's just kind of annoying uh, so let's go like this let's get another not fertilizer harvester right there let's pop that off and that and then we'll end up losing this guy here but let's get this out of here probably lose some of those yep definitely lost some of those all right um let's see here item duck Come down and just connect him like that. Might as well do the same thing with the fluid. Pop you off. That's fine. That's whatever. Power we want to be a little bit a little snakier. That's gonna come down like this. Well, we're gonna. Sorry, I'll take a little short break there. Take a little break there. Um, I want that uh, range extender on that. So that's filling into there, which is which is fine for now. That's whatever. <clears throat> I do want to automate it, so we're gonna have to create uh, another oven. Uh, range increase of two I think is what I'm using. I'm going to get rid of fertilizer and the composter. Get, go. There you go. Obviously I'm going to tidy that back up because it's stupid the way it is right now. Uh, not going to be able to reach it. Okay. And, oh, crap. So that only hits those guys. Range extender. And he grabs everybody. Now, if you know something that will make um, cacti grow faster, like, uh, isn't there a lily pad? Lily pad of growth or something. Growth lamp. Lamp of growth. Um, let me look this up real quick. Okay, um, it's gonna take a little bit more research than I'm willing to put in right now. Uh, being as I'm in the middle of making a video, I'll um, I'll get to that shortly. Um, now we need to make another daytime happen, and we need to make an electric furnace. Furnace. Uh, redstone furnace, that's what we want. Copper. Copper guy. Gold. We can make that now. Uh, we can probably make that now. I also noticed that these changed with an update, so they don't keep my. They're not the exacto craft anymore, so they don't keep my uh, my stuff in them. It's annoying. Pulverized lead. Why are you here? There. Uh, let's get uh, bricks because I need two brick blocks. Oh, the gold is going to be essential because I need to extend this. 
Oh, look at that. Pink, pink. Don't even have to find anything else. What do we need? Copper. So, this will automate my harvesting. I mean, I mean, if I need copper. If I need more, I can always just add more floors and more harvesters. Or move it all and make it just a gigantic bigger one. Uh, not a big deal. There we go. So, what do we got for item ducks? What's the recipe on this? No. What? A recipe on item ducks. It's lead with tin around it. So I think we're going to need a ton more of this lead. Let's go with that. Boom, boom, boom. I think that should be good. So. Let's set this up here. Since we're already coming down in here, and we want to get into there, let's go with... So this is where the sludge is coming in, the power is going out. So obviously we're going to go this way with the item. I wish I could go into bat form and go down there, but I have to dig it. Dig it. Um, power needs to be a thing here. Bam. Uh, this side is going to be that. And then we're going to go right into here. Oh, this is such a mess in here. Hmm. Maybe I can use those pipes. I'll come down into the floor. And the floor will just be this, and I'll go right up into there, and it'll just send it along. I think that'll work. So let me get those pipes. Uh, give me one second. Okay, so I got those pipes, the build craft pipes. Why is it so dark feeling down here? Um, we're gonna go like this. We're gonna accelerate it right out of the gate. So we'll go bing, 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 and just boom. Let's just move it along. So this whole area is just gonna be like construction-y and let's give it right as it rounds a turn here a couple of extending it's gonna still go the right way perfect I mean I could probably put um, which we call blocks here but we'll deal with that let's make sure this is going to work grab a uh, Cactus to test. Cact test. That's what it'll be, a cact test. And once I get rid of this, I mean, this could be a huge building. I could just make one gigantic one there. Um, I'd push it away further. But if, if it comes to that and I need that, then that's what I'll do. But right now, I don't need it, so... We got so many different types of. So boom, go like that. This guy is gonna have that. He's going down. Let's go down here. Boom. Moving along, popping right in there. And totally taking care of it. Awesome. So now, let's get. this stuff. Let's get the uh, the items from the area over here. I don't know what happened there. Maybe brain fart or something. Um, let me let's 
isn't gonna happen ever. Man, it's a mess over here. So, we've got you like that. We're gonna go for now here. And then down into here. There we go. And right down into here. Send it all the way into there. Boom. There's just so much. If there's a way to make this easier, let me know, because that is just craziness. All right, and we'll finish this up by completing the connection. Let me get rid of some of this crap in here that I don't need. Uh, you, you, you. Okay. For some reason, I have a unused iron pickaxe in there as well. No idea why. Okay. So now, pop you off. Chop you. Put you together. And everything should be peachy keen. Make sure this whole area is safe. Don't need any surprise visits. There. This will all have glass in it too. I'm gonna do all that. All right, I think that is where we are going to end this episode. Um, now that we have those automated, I'll get rid of the cows on the top too, but. Now that this is automated, this will just send guys in here. They'll get cooked up, and they'll be sent along to make into more biofuel. Awesome. So that's something that will just happen naturally. Perfect. All right. I thank you for tuning in. I am Dave from the Kodo. Uh, check out my channel for some more uh, videos as well as tutorials. And if you have any suggestions on anything that we did today as well as... Um, going to be setting up the mob farm over there let me know in the comment section below uh, like the video if it was enjoyable to you and like always good luck and have fun